video. My name is Mike. I want to talk about uh, canteens. I put a little video together uh, a couple weeks ago because I was looking for a product that doesn't exist. Um, there's some similarities to what I wanted, and uh, I couldn't find it, so uh, I decided to go with this Nalgene uh, based on the original military version. So uh, the reason I'm doing this is just to help you out, so you don't have to go through everything I went through. <laughs> I filled this USGI canteen up, which was mine, was in the Marine Corps back in the mid-80s. It actually says 1973 on the bottom of it, so uh, who knows what I was drinking back then. And um, I took that canteen, I used it to fill up this canteen, and I don't know if you can see it, but it doesn't come all the way to the top, so there's actually room for more water in this, so it actually holds more than this one. Another nice thing about this Nalgene here is that it's got this texture on it. It's not a rubbery grippy texture necessarily like a, it would be like on the bottom of like a climbing shoe or something but it's grippy I mean when it's wet even you're not going to drop it which is nice and just the contours of it there's even a little divot on the top here it just fits your hand nice to drink and, and uh, you know what I like about it is it's a thinner profile so when you wear it on your belt you know you're not going to bump it with your arms so much anyhow um, after I did that I filled this one to the brim and then pour that into your standard Nalgene bottle that we've all seen for years. And you can see, it actually fills it up to over 32 ounces. And there, but there's still room. You actually put another ounce or two in this bottle. Um, this is what we all bought. They're great. The wide mouth is pretty standard. A lot of companies make that same size. And now uh, water filter companies make water filters that screw right on this. And that's great. And when this, can't, this little cup came out for it, fantastic now you can boil water with it it's great but it's bulky and I know that a lot of civilian manufacturers uh, have made backpacks that where these fit in them the pockets are sized really for these it's all terrific but um, I still prefer this I just like narrow profile and it's, it's really made for what I want to use it for and um, the only thing that's lacking for me is, is a wide mouth and really the only benefit to the wide mouth is you can cramp snow or other things in there if that's what you want to do. I found this product on eBay and the guy on the phone, uh, not on the phone, but via email was really nice. His answers to my questions weren't as succinct as I wish they would have been, but uh, it does fit in a standard U.S. government issue canteen cup, which I'll get to in a minute. Uh, but he told me it was BPA free and uh, a couple things I noticed when I got it on the bottom, it's made in China. I'm not real happy about that. And uh, it's uh, in, this, in the triangle on the bottom, it's uh, number seven, and then the letter's PC underneath. And uh, I hit Wikipedia up on that, which we all know how great that is. You know, don't go there for anything controversial. <laughs> but I, I'm trusting them on this. This still has BPA in it. Um, the number seven is interesting because if it's spe specifically noted that it's BPA-free, then it apparently is. And uh, that's what the Nalgene bottles are, so, I don't know, that's a good thing. Also, the weird thing about this was, I mean, it cost me 10 bucks, but including the shipping, I thought it was great. I like the idea of the wide mouth. Um, it came with a carabiner on it, which, who cares? The funny thing about the carabiner was every time it hit it, it was so loud. Listen to that thing. Uh, this thing is like a symphony in, in the forest. Uh, you know, if you want to try to be quiet, you don't want something that if you bang it up against something, it's going to sing for a mile. So, not the greatest there, a waste of money. But at least I know, and now you know. You don't have to be buying this either. Just, just go with these. Amazon.com, they're like eight bucks a piece, and uh, they're fantastic. Now, why am I so jazzed about this? Back in the old days, <laughs> I know that they're, they're uh, getting away from canteens in the military now, and they're going to water bladders, which I've used. They're fine, but I've had them break on me. They're a bitch to clean. Uh, so if you're going to go out somewhere, if you might be somewhere long term, you might not want to depend on a bladder. I think a bladder is a great backup. It's a great way to, you can roll up a bladder and have it as an extra thing in your pack. Fantastic, but I'm a canteen guy. And um, standard U.S. government deal right there. I'm going to get to this new product here in a minute, too. It's pretty cool. So the neat thing about the uh, canteen cup was always... Um, there's a stove that comes with it. Okay, so you make your fire, heat up your food.